What's up, Redcoats? Welcome back to the Rourke Shop and the triumphant return of the Question Hat. Red's Rourke Shop. I understand that this isn't the same hat as the last question hat, but I actually have a lot of trilbies, so it'll probably be a while before I have to use the same one twice. So I didn't really know what I wanted to make a vlog about today, so I was dinking around the internet and I found this list of a 30-day vlog challenge. But the rules of said challenge said I had to take at least a minute on each question and separate it into 30 different vlogs. So in lieu of subjecting you to that nonsense, I'm gonna go ahead and try and answer all 30 questions and go. Five facts about yourself. Uh, let's see. I cut and color my own hair. My favorite thing to do is eat. I am the most empathetic person I know. I have an incredible energy threshold for someone so sedimentary, and I am really bad at favorite questions. What is your favorite band? You know, I feel like you aren't listening to me. It's always hard for me to pick a favorite because I like so many things, but right now I'm hooked on this band called Van Canto that my friend James turned me on to. They're a German metal band, and they only use drums as instruments, and everything else is acapella. It's really cool. Talk about your favorite book. That's probably the hardest of all the favorite questions, but I guess I'll just have to go with The Maltese Falcon by Dashiell Hammett. Favorite movie? This is like impossible. Gosh, there's so many, but the most recent one that I really, really loved was Mad Max Fury Road. Go see it, it's radical. Favorite food? Oh good, an easy one. Mashed potatoes, all across the board, preferably with gravy. Introduce us to your pets. Aiden helps me poop. Jinx is smart. Talk pretty. <laughs> Buddy likes to dig. And Zoe is a bit of a derp. What's your favorite joke? The past, the present, and the future walk into a bar. It was tense. Biggest pet peeve? Negativity. Worst job you've ever had? Probably working at Chuck E. Cheese where I traumatized children and they traumatized me back. Best job you've ever had? I worked at Blizzard Entertainment for two years and that was really fun, but it was also really stressful, so I'm gonna have to say bartending because I really like bartending. What is a pet that you don't have that you wish you did? Definitely a goat. Preferably one of the tiny ones or one of the fainting ones. Or a tiny fainting one. Do you have children? <laughs> I can't even take care of myself. How's your relationship with your parents? I actually have a really white picket fence relationship with my parents. Like they're both still together and they've always been very supportive of me and they're like my best friends in a lot of ways, but. Hello? Hey, I think my phone is broken. What do you mean it's broken? Did you drop it? No, then what's the problem? It won't flip. It won't flip? Like my pictures won't turn anymore. Like no matter what I do, like it, they won't turn. Did you turn on your screen lock? No, I don't think so. Do that thing where you drag up the screen and open the other menu. Okay, in the very right hand corner there should be like a little lock inside of a circle. Okay, all right, press that. How did you do that? If you could repeat high school, would you? Um, no. Absolutely not. Not if you paid me all of King Midas' gold would I repeat high school. What's your zodiac sign? I'm a cancer. Who is your male celebrity crush? Ugh, there's so many! Who is your female celebrity crush? There's still so many! How's your room decorated? We got Night Before Christmas and Supernatural, Casablanca, always a classic, Ninja Turtles at the top, Boy From Oz, lots of artwork, John Green, that's a needlepoint garris that Kim Demon made me. Jack Skellington door knocker. Art. License plate. Tobuscus Adventures and a signed Bo Burnham. Ten framed issues of Via for Vendetta. And seven o'clock. Woo! What are you most afraid of? Definitely extremism in any form. Even in, and almost especially in, things that I myself believe in. Do you have a favorite quote? Now why wasn't that question with all the other favorite questions? Get it together, vlog challenge! That's another hard one because there's so many, but since I've already got it on my mind, I'm gonna go ahead and go with my favorite quote from the Maltese Falcon. He looked rather pleasantly like a blonde Satan. Do you have any hidden talents? Uh, I don't really think I have any hidden talents, except I can make this noise. If you could meet anybody living or dead, who would it be? George Carlin. If you could pick any one superpower, what would it be? Eh, this is a hard one, but my instinct says going with morphing into animals, so long as I don't have to be green like Beast Boy, but if I did have to be green, I would probably take power over all the elements. Or time manipulation. Ah! What's your favorite holiday? Thanksgiving followed very closely by Halloween. Are you still friends with somebody from kindergarten? Why, yes. This psycho. Do you have a best friend of the opposite sex? Ironically enough, the same psycho. What's something you're willing to confess to us? Um, I really like picking my nose. A lot. What are you thankful for? 
Uh, I'm thankful for a lot of things, but really the thing that's on my mind the most right now is you guys and all your support. And I know, I know, it's Abby, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. How do you feel about the 30 day vlog challenge? It was harder than expected, but I guess I didn't hate it. I guess a better question would be, did you guys enjoy it? Like and subscribe if you did, and leave me comments and let me know what else you want to see me do. As always, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it, and all my contact information is down in the description. Have a wonderful weekend, and I'll see you guys next time.